Hey, what is going on, everybody? It is the Gen. Welcome back to another YouTube video. Today, we've got another season of Ultra Hardcore Survival with 10 beautiful individuals. You got Amusion, Chaotic Maxer, Dragon Legend, Eggman, Flazzle, Guy Volcano, me, Trophy Search, Ziggy, and Cookies. So, the rules of the game are as follows it's a 2000 by 2000 world that shrinks to 200 by 200 over the course of an hour and a half. There will be no strip mining allowed. You can staircase and you can also mine the sounds, but there will be no strip mining allowed on the server. It is eternal day and it's also cut clean. Whenever you mine ores or kill animals, it um, automatically drops cooked food or smelted ores, which is ideal and makes the game go so, so much quicker. I used a default uh, map setup with a, a couple parameters that made sure that there was at least two sand temples i actually see one from spawn right here <laughs> at least two villages and at least one ocean monument temple somewhere on the map so pretty exciting stuff i already know fwazzle has some ideas yes it's steve games by the way we're all steves so we're all gonna separate into our calls and we're gonna get this uhc season underway and we'll see you all in episode number one Hey, what is going on guys? It is the Jed. Welcome back to another YouTube video. Today, we're starting off some ultra hardcore survival on my own custom server. It is season four of Jetcraft UHC. We've got 10 lovely individuals ready to go and battle it out in the amazing, incredible UHC. Minecraft's doing a revival, so I thought I'd jump on that bandwagon. All right, it looks like we're all good to go, ladies and gentlemen. So here we go to start Jetcraft UHC season four. Three, two, one, slash UH, start. And here we go. And we got a swamp spawn, nice. And here we go, we're good to go to begin UHC. It's lagging a little bit, that's okay. But we got four apples so far, which is ideal. Cool, that's our sixth apple now. That's ideal. Eight apples, okay. So we start, we're what? We're like, we're less than four minutes in and we've already gotten eight apples. It's pretty ideal, it's an excellent start. And where are we exactly? We're, we're a decent ways away from the border, so that's good. Okay, let's um, get going. Uh, I want to do... I want to get a sword and start um, taking out some things. Let's get going on some uh, feathers and chicken to start with. I know I saw some cows. I think I might have taken them out. Either that or they ran off. And I'm going to need to find some cows. It's literally just... Server things like blocks and stuff that seems to be lagging the most. The player doesn't seem to be going back at all, which is ideal. So it's a ravine here, which I think I'll I'll explore in a second. As soon as I go and I, I find myself uh, something like this. Already heard some zombies, so that's ideal. Got my sounds all the way up to the top, by the way. Trying to make sure I hear everything, which is why the sounds are up so high. So if um, they seem really loud in your ears, that's the only reason. So far so good though, we've got a, a swamp, apples, lots of reeds. All we need is some of those um, cows so we can get some of that leather. 
Might just grab a bunch of iron from down in that ravine over there and then just... Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get some iron from the ravine. And then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to set out on the surface and have a look for some things. 1600, 1300. So that's, uh, that's a good, um, that's a good 400 blocks in from the border. So we don't have to worry too much about that for now. Uh, but, uh, I'm going to scoop up the ravine, head inland, basically towards zero, zero. And then after that, we can go find some cows, get the books going. <laughs> Get a bunch of food ready to go, and we should be good to go. Oh, okay. That could have been way worse. Right, so we got a lot of water down there, and a sheep apparently. Dear, 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 dear. So no iron it looks like, which is frustrating. Okay, there's some over there. That's ideal, an eight vein of iron. Of course, nothing spectacular. Yeah, so it looks like that's all this ravine is actually going to give us, which is unfortunate. So let's do that. Let's do that, and then let's do that. So let's dip into this cave over here in hopes of finding some of that sweet, sweet iron stuff. I've done a lot of these things in this season and decided a lot of these decisions based on the fact that I just, I just want the game to be more PvP focused. Rather than just a bunch of people dying just because they happen to be on the surface when there were zombies. So that's exactly why I've implemented half of the things that I've implemented. And um, hopefully that um, makes the game go faster, makes everyone a little bit more even, and allows everybody to have a very equal say in um, this game. Everyone to get an equal chance to win. So that looks like a cave over there. So, yeah, this looks promising. Uh, gravel here though, so I'm actually, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna make a shovel and just grab the, the flint required for all these. I'm just gonna farm up all of this gravel. Sorry again about the noise. How much flint did that give us? Almost a stack. So good, yeah, okay, so let's just make another one. Alright, so that's ideal. We've got, uh, two, two stacks and 31. Let's go over to this plains biome. Oh, we're at the border. So it looks like we're actually right at the back corner of the map here, which is not necessarily ideal. We've got horses, but I'm gonna spare you guys. I don't take out the damn horses. I don't, I don't wanna be that guy, you know? So it looks like we're not gonna be that uh, first death in the first 20 minutes of the game. Actually, I don't wanna jinx it here. We still got 47 seconds, so uh... Knock on wood there. Well, let's just uh, skedaddle away from the border, just closer in. Look for some cows and uh, a few more chickens. I'm gonna get a, enough feathers here to uh, equal the amount of flint that we have, which will be difficult to find enough chickens to do that, but that's not impossible, of course. And that's the end of episode number one, ladies and gentlemen. We'll see you back in episode number two.